Hello guys, welcome to my first YouTube video. And in this video I'm going to show you how to adapt a 2 inch filter for a telescope to a normal Celestron tiering. Any camera brand uh, accepts this method. So what you will notice is that if you by error bought a 2 inch filter you will not be able to adapt it to your tiering no matter what. Uh, the, the thread in the filter is a little bit too big for the tiering so uh, you may think that you need to buy an adapter for your uh, tiering to fit in your, your filter but that's wrong if you see here the tiering has screws with a hex head on there so it has three screws in total and by removing those screws you can actually fit this ring in, sorry, sorry, this filter in. So I'm going to show you how. Okay, so the first step is to remove those three screws. I'm using this screwdriver, magnetic, because they were really small screws, so you don't want them falling off when you unscrew them. So we screw to the right, and they come out really easily. Put them over here. I'm really gonna put my microfiber so that they don't roll away. And well, there it goes. <laughs> so okay. now, as you can see from the inside, the tearing doesn't have a thread right here so these screws what they do is let's get a focus there we go so they just uh, put pressure on the inside so that the this piece stays in place but it doesn't have a thread on it it has like this little kind of like a latch here that helps that uh well helps to stay in place with the with the screws so now uh, most filters if not all filters have these little uh, holes in the sides so that you can screw the filter out Wait, I'm sorry I think I'm going the wrong way there we go yeah. so what you have to do is carefully with your fingernails screw the filter out like so. Now you'll have the glass piece Oh, so carefully no touching the surface just so you can get your greasy fingerprints on it you'll grab your empty tearing and carefully place your glass inside now you'll grab, you'll, you'll grab the outer part and put it in now, as this doesn't have a thread, it can be a little bit uh, like bumpy. You know, you can have like this little bump outside, and it doesn't matter because these uh, screws will put pressure in it no matter what, no matter if it's a little bit upwards. So, and now you have your tearing with the filter included. What you will do now is put these screws back in. And now, after you screw your your screws back in, you have the, this finished piece so it's really convenient because it has the filter inside of it you don't have to screw any filters in and you can adapt this to your camera and to your telescope right away so thanks for watching see you in the next video